If you are a believer in the paranormal, then Marina Seren's story is one you won't want to miss. From her claims of being a ET contactee to her past lives as Nazi generals. There's a lot to learn in this True Facts video. This is Lion's Crown. The German agenda was not like a native one, native one, native one, native one, I have people in the SS who were neither supporting the crimes that many of the SS were doing. It's just not the same. And that's not what I want. That's not what they die for. They die for. Lady met for the first time. For the first time. For the first time. Before we start with today's video, I just wanted to take a moment to express my gratitude. I want to give a special shout out to Ricky Baker, who recently became a member of my Patreon page as Lions Ground Insider. Ricky, thank you very much for your support. Let's jump into today's video. Did you know that Marina Saran claims to have been an SS general in one of her past lives? I was one of the pillars of all of this. I was a real medium and I was an SS general. Another one I was shown that I was an SS general. I was not an evil person when I was an SS general. However, when asked for the name of the SS general she allegedly was, during a live stream, Marina Seren panicked and was unable to provide a name. What was the name of that general? What, do you know the name that oh, you were? Shit. I've been given many names. <laughs> hmm. So, about past lives, so yeah, that one, yeah. I, can, I can tell you the specific name, yeah. I can tell you the specific name. Did you know since I was a little boy, I always have looked up to America? My country, the Netherlands, was one of the countries occupied by Nazi Germany. And America, Poland, Canada and the British liberated us. Every year on May 5th, we remember and honor the victims and heroes of World War II. And we celebrate the fact we are free. It's called Bevrijdingsdag in English, Liberation Day. In addition, my number one viewers on my YouTube channel are Americans. And they have always supported me. So whenever someone discriminates or insults Americans, I feel a strong connection to the United States and stand up for them including Canadians and British or Polish. 
Did you know that Marina Seren recently insulted all Americans? Fuck America because he's now taking over. And did you know that Marina Seren shouted Sieg Heil multiple times, all less than a minute in a conversation with deciphering my experience? Sieg Heil! Sieg oh. Heil! Thanks to Operation Haiyan, we are your fucking America government. So fuck America because he's now taking over. You're the one that titled yourself the Nazi. You're the one that titled no, yourself so the funny. SS general. I'm You're the one that was saying Sieg Heil. Yeah, Sieg Heil. Yep. Yeah, you Sieg say that. Heil. It rolls it rolls off your tongue with such ease. Sieg Heil. Yeah, you love that. Sieg Heil, motherfucker. Yep, you love it. I love it. I know, I can tell. Because I love my SS brothers and because I love my real sisters. Did you know that Marina Seren writes on her website that she has special gifts, which she sells as a service, starting from 111 euros to up to 333. My brother of another mother, Stephen Gambian, put Marina Seren's gifts to the test by asking her what he wrote on a piece of paper. In Marina's case, I'm gonna offer her a unique opportunity to prove that her superpowers are real. Or, she can get out of fantasy land and stop pretending to have superpowers. And my challenge is very, very simple. I have a billet here. This is something that we uh, use in magic shows. It's used in mentalism shows. A billet is just, you know, a little slip of paper and you write something on it. So I have written something on this sheet of paper for Marina, the psychic with superpowers. And if Marina can tell me correctly, and by the way, I have shared this with one person <laughs> who I trust in the world, uh, who can verify that it is pre-written, what is written here will stay written on here and I will keep it here in my studio uh, in a locked box. I'm gonna put up, I'll take a picture of it later in the locked box. So this, is Marina's superpower challenge. If Marina can correctly, with her superpowers, tell me what is written on this slip of paper correctly, I will sign over the deed to my house. To this day, Marina Seren evaded this request. Did you know that Marina Seren claims to be no Nazi sympathizer? And has never ever stated that she condones the Holocaust or World War II crimes. You know, I'm not, I can't be a Nazi in any way of shape or form. However, she has been known to romantize World War II by mixing it with her fabrication that Hitler's agenda was negatively influenced by alien extraterrestrial intelligent life. With this, she emphasizes that the Nazis had a positive agenda which is something that the Nazi sympathizers often do. When I married in my simultaneous incarnation as SS general to Maria Orsic, I supported her. I have people in the SS who were neither supporting the crimes that many of the SS were doing, but you know, that's why, that's why I say that it's not black or white. I know that the real, society, the real women and the SS generals, specifically Himmler, didn't have it so well at the end because they started to become dissonant in terms of ideologies and in terms of actions, mostly actions. The real were very, very, well, I'm also talking about my past life, <laughs> um, my parallel incarnation, simultaneous incarnation as a real. We were very, 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 let's say, hard based we were women that never wanted to commit any crime against humanity i mean our mission was just the opposite to bring peace to earth did you know that marina seren frequently appears as a guest on the live stream of brian Rue? i think you had an ss earring with one s in yes one. yes that, oh that was so sweet marina <laughs> gotta have you as a guest <laughs> <laughs> well, you're courageous. I mean, you stand for truth, and so do I. We, we should stand for truth. An old acquaintance of mine, who has recently turned from a peaceful, wise Buddhist to an extremist. Headlines have featured stories about Ruhe showing pictures of him giving the Hitler salute. Ah, great. 
and deliberately attempting to look like Adolf Hitler, who looks good on you. Did you know that Marina Zaren has made anti-Semitic statements, including referring to YouTube as Jew-tube? YouTube CEO named Susan has a Jewish background and the platform was acquired by Google a couple of years ago in 2016, I believe, and it was founded by Larry Page and Sergey Brin, and both of whom also have Jewish backgrounds. Not so smart. Did you know that Marina Zaren is guilty of falsely reporting one of my videos for privacy violation, but lost the case? Additionally, Patreon removed Marina Zaren's page, as it goes against the platform's guidelines. Did you know that her second Patreon page was terminated too? Did you know that Patreon clearly outlines the rules during registration? Did you know that she was aware of this beforehand? Did you know that she agreed to these rules but didn't follow them? Financially benefiting from Patreon for activities such as denying the Holocaust and promoting Nazi propaganda or mixing it. Did you know that her true nature came to light? She verbally abused one of her Patreon staff members on Twitter. And also her former followers who left her. Did you know that she threatened to sabotage my income? Did you know that this is not the first time? Did you know that she is dishonest with her followers because she started to damage my income first? She started it all. She tried to flag one of my videos under false pretenses, but YouTube protected me. Thank God. Did you know that she flagged one video more than 12 times for privacy violations? Even though she is a public figure, no personal or identifiable information was shared, only online publications. Did you know that she switched to OnlyFans? Did you know that she stated she will be only doing sensual photography? Did you know that she discusses very serious topics on OnlyFans? Did you know that Marina Seren has stated that not all members of the SS were supporters of Hitler's crimes and ideologies and some even attempted to kill him? I have people in the SS who were neither supporting the crimes that many of the SS were doing, but you know, that's why that's why I say that it's not black or white. I have that experience and there was much conflict. There was a lot of conflict. Not all people were agreeing in this thing, but many people were agreeing on the other thing. It was just like that. But it, originally, the Pleiadians are the ones who were helping um, the Germans. So the German agenda was not like a native one. While it's true, not all members of the SS supported Hitler's crimes or ideologies, the SS was also responsible for committing many crimes during the Holocaust and World War II. Many members of the SS were involved in the planning and execution of the Holocaust and played a key role in carrying out Hitler's genocidal policies. Did you know that Marina Seren has gotten into arguments on Twitter, including making a disrespectful comment about the flag of Japan? This type of behavior is not acceptable and shows a lack of respect for other cultures. Did you know that Marina Seren has claimed that she can speak to, well, spirits, ghosts or whatever? Because sometimes my customer have even received certain messages from their spirit guides that I just received telepathically. While some people believe in the existence of ghosts and the ability of communicate with the spirits of the deceased, there is no scientific evidence to support these claims. Did you know that Marina Seren has known to say Quotes, I have black. I have also black friends. Or Jewish friends. I have Jewish friends. In an attempt to prove that she is not a racist, this is a common tactic used by racists to try and deflect accusations of racism. It is not a valid defense, I have to tell you. Did you know that Marina Seren has claimed that the word Nazi was an abbreviation for National Socialist? And that it was originally used to refer to a minority of good national socialists? However, this is not accurate. The term Nazi was actually an abbreviation for the official name of the political party in Germany led by Adolf Hitler, the National Socialist German Workers' Party. 
de National Socialist Deutsche Arbeidspartij, or NSDAP. The term Nazi became a derogatory term after the end of World War II due to the crimes committed by the Nazi regime. While it is true that not all members of the National Socialist German Works Party were criminals, the party was responsible for committing a number of crimes against humanity during the Holocaust and World War II, and many of its members were involved in these crimes. Did you know that Marina Seren has posted a selfie wearing a long sleeve shirt with the Black Sun symbol on it? This symbol has been appropriated by neo-Nazi and white supremacist groups and should not be used or displayed. Did you know that Marina Seren has claimed to have filed a police report against me on defamation grounds with the Spanish police, but has refused to provide the address of the police station where the report was filed? When I contacted the police myself, they informed me that there is no report in their system about me and Marina Seren claims that it takes time for a report to appear in their system. Well, it has been months now and since the alleged report was filed and there is still no record of it. Huh. This suggests that Marina Seren lied about filing the report and is therefore guilty of online defamation. Did you know that Marina Seren has claimed that her father was a lawyer for years and that she has tons of attorney friends and that she knows the law very well? However, if this is true, it is strange that she will forget the requirements for filing a report on defamation grounds. In Spain, the person who is the subject of the report must speak or write false rumors in order for a report to be filed. Additionally, the person filing the report must have suffered damages as a result of the false rumors and may not, I repeat, may not be a public figure. So if Marina Seren truly knows the law very well, she would have known that these requirements must be met in order to file a report. Did you know that Marina Seren has claimed to have psychic abilities and to be a medium? Because sometimes my customer have even received certain messages from their spirit guides that I just received telepathically. And has even offered these services for sale on a website. However, there is no scientific evidence to support the claim that psychic abilities or mediumship are real. And it is important to be skeptical of such claims. Many people who claim to have these abilities have been unable to demonstrate them under controlled scientific conditions. In some cases, people who claim to have psychic abilities or to be mediums may use tricks or techniques to deceive people into thinking that they have genuine abilities. It is important to be skeptical of claims about psychic abilities or mediumship and to carefully evaluate the evidence before accepting them as true. Here's a rhetorical question. Since when is it legal to sell fraudulent or deceptive services? Did you know that last week I met my girlfriend's niece, who happens to be a lawyer, and I showed her my video about Marina Seren. While watching the video, my girlfriend's niece nodded her head in disbelief throughout the entire video and said that what Marina Seren is doing is similar to promoting the ETA in Spain. It is the glorification of terrorism. Did you know that people continue to believe Marina Seren's stories, even though she has not able to prove any of them? It is important to critically evaluate the claims of others and to require evidence before accepting them as true. Did you know that Marina Seren is trying to capitalize on the millions of World War II victims by mixing fabricated borderline conspiracy theories with true stories? This is not a respectful or appropriate way to approach a subject and it is important to remember the real people and events that were affected by the war. Efforts to harass me and to defamate me as a Nazi sympathizer. I, I wanted to let them know publicly that I went to the Madrid, um, the, the police station of Madrid, to the police corps of Spain and I successfully denounced them for crime of slander because it is, a, it is something that has hurt my honor and my profession and my life and my friends and relationships in general. Well, so you've never been a Nazi sympathizer. That's I've never like been a Nazi sympathizer. See Heil, fuck America. See Heil, see Heil, see Heil, mother. See Heil, fuck America. See Heil, see Heil, see Heil, mother. 
See Heil. Fuck America. See Heil. See Heil. See Heil, mother. See Heil. Fuck America. See Heil. See Heil. See Heil, mother. Watch the extended version of this video now. Available exclusively to my Patreon and YouTube supporters. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Remember the force of nature. Lionsground.com.